The electric car has the characteristics of quiet acceleration and automatic driving. I'm used to it, so I don't want to switch back to a gasoline car. An increasing number of Taiwanese drivers are choosing electric cars. In 2023, the streets saw 25,000 electric vehicles, reflecting a 53% increase from the previous year. On the global stage, however, the story changes. Research from international auto market analysis shows a slowdown in global electric vehicle sales. In January 2024, electric vehicle sales jumped by 69% year-on-year, yet they dropped by 26% compared to the previous December. Facing uncertain futures, major automotive companies are re-evaluating their strategies for electric vehicles, with some even pausing their plans. As for Germany, a European powerhouse that sells cars globally, they realized that in 2024, China's electric vehicle manufacturing capacity and low cost will be their great opponent, and that their advantage is still the traditional gasoline engine. If they give up that, it would be difficult to compete head-to-head -head with China. Mercedes-Benz has pulled back from its commitment to exclusively sell electric vehicles by 2030. Toyota's chairman estimates electric vehicles will make up only about 30% of the global market. Also, Porsche's CFO has indicated that the EU might postpone its plan to ban fuel-burning cars by 2035. Despite their role as icons of innovation, electric vehicles encounter significant hurdles, such as limited charging infrastructure and harsh weather conditions. Addressing these issues is essential for continued growth in electric vehicle sales. Xie Yilun Zhong Derong, Jamie Lin Pinzon, TVBS World Taiwan.